Hello, welcome to the Thomas Hospital Birth Center. I'm Tiffany Mosley, Director of Women's and Children's Services. We're going to look at what it will be like when you come to have your baby with us. Around 34 weeks of pregnancy, you're gonna to come to our admission center and get pre-registered. At that time, we may be able to go ahead and collect some of your information to make your admission process smoother when you come in. When you're scheduled for delivery, you'll still need to present to the admitting office to get your armband on the day you're arriving. If you go into labor at any point, you should always present to the emergency room and they will bring you immediately up to labor and delivery. Once you've admitted to labor and delivery, you will be in one of our labor delivery and recovery rooms. These rooms are spacious and designed to allow plenty of room for you and your family to welcome your infant. While you're in this room, you will complete the entire labor process utilizing the anesthesia type of your choice. And after you deliver your baby, your baby should be able to remain with you in this room for a couple of hours while you recover from that initial postpartum period. Afterwards, you will move to one of our postpartum rooms. All of the rooms at Thomas Hospital Birth Center are private rooms with a full bathroom and a shower, so you and your family can be comfortable throughout your entire stay. If your baby needs any kind of special care, then we will transfer the baby to the special care nursery where we can provide any care and services that an infant might need from 32 weeks of gestation and above. While in the special care nursery, you will still be able to visit your infant and you will be on our postpartum hall just across from the nursery. If you require a cesarean delivery, we have two operating rooms here in the labor and delivery department. So we will quickly be able to perform a cesarean if there were to be an emergency. If you are scheduled for cesarean delivery, we will admit you and take you directly to the operating room and then back to your same recovery room where your infant should be able to accompany you. At any time during your stay, you are welcome to have your baby with you so long as he or she is healthy. For uncomplicated postpartum moms and babies, you may be able to have the same nurse caring for both of you so that the interruptions can be minimized and so that you have a consistent presence coming to your room for the whole shift. We will be able to assist you with breastfeeding and or preparing bottles for your infant so that you feel comfortable and prepared to do infant care when you go home. Our babies are cared for by a staff of neonatologists and neonatal nurse practitioners, all of whom are experts in neonatal care. We also have a lactation staff who will be able to help you with establishing breastfeeding and will address any concerns that you have while you are here. Our lactation staff is also available for outpatient visits if you have concerns that extend after you are discharged from the hospital. Most patients will stay with us for approximately 48 hours following a vaginal delivery and longer for a cesarean delivery. During your labor and delivery and postpartum stay, we have sleeping accommodations so that the second parent can be with you as your family grows. We want to support your family in learning about this new little person who you'll soon be taking home with you. However, at present, our visitor policy is subject to change, so please check with us close to your delivery time and see how many visitors will be allowed. Certainly, you will be allowed to have your support person, but possibly even more family will be able to attend and meet your new baby. While all of our rooms are private and we have accommodations for sleeping, we do want you to bring any comfort items that you may want from home. It is perfectly fine for you to bring your pillows, blankets. If you have robes that you want to be in your postpartum photos with your baby, please include all of those things when you're packing. All infants must go home from the hospital in a car seat that is appropriate and safe for them. The rear seat of the car is always the preferred spot for an infant. Please make sure that you go ahead and install the base of your car seat before you come to the hospital. That way, leaving on your day of discharge will be an even more smooth transition. We look forward to your joining us to expand your family here at the Thomas Hospital Birth Center. Please reach out and let us know if there's any questions that you have that we can answer prior to your delivery. We are so excited to be a part of your birth.